Sheila Gashumba, born 7th February 1996, is a multi talented young girl who is very hard working. Sheila started working at the age of 10 on WBS TV as a news anchor and news reporter for Kids News. On becoming a teenager, Sheila was promoted to the teens show called Teens Club, a leading youth show in Uganda. In 2009, Sheila received recognition as the youngest journalist accredited in the whole world to cover the well-known Chogam Commonwealth Heads of Government meeting which was presided over by the Queen of England, Queen Elizabeth, in Kampala, Uganda. She has worked for a widely read daily newspaper called Daily Monitor in a column called Chogam Teens, and also Sheila briefly was a writer for the popular teens pullout in the New Vision newspaper, Swag. Sheila loves her own proposals because she strongly believes that she was born with a creative mind. Sheila is unstoppable. By the age of 12, she had written proposals for a TV show, radio show and clothing line, among several other creative and mind-blowing ideas. Sheila also currently bounced back on the TV screen with a show called Teen Nation, which airs every Saturday morning at 11 a.m. on Uganda's number one television station, NTV, which is broadcasted live in the Great Lakes region. It's yet another amazing Saturday here in Kampala, Uganda. You're watching East Africa's best TV channel, NTV Uganda. And quite another reminder, it's Sheila Gashumba bringing you the show this time around. Yeah, we're here to represent. Let's get the clips of the madness. You know, the soccer, the, everything's going down here. Check it out. We go, we go. <laughs> My name is Punjo Muhammad. Muhammad. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Ah. To serve you. In 2012, Sheila started up a charity foundation called Young Bodies Big Hearts with teens from middle class families that believe in giving back to the society and helping the less privileged with the little that they have to make the world a better place to live. This year, Young Bodies Big Hearts decided to put a smile on the faces of children living in Kampala's biggest slum called Katanga at an orphanage named African Children of God's Image during the Easter season with fruits, clothes, biscuits and juice. I'm Sheila Gashumba, Chinechwina Bachita Young Bodies Big Hearts, Twekunga Nanga Teens of Uganda, that we can help other young children that are suffering. Usually, we are to in your projects. And this time round, to our government, you know, Easter to just you have an abadi in Katanga. You know, what slums in Emma. In 2012, Sheila won Most Gifted Teen at the Super Talent Awards 2012. In March 2013, she was given an all-round award for participating in all activities at Kaboja International School. Still in 2013, she recently won Hottest Teens TV Presenter at the annual Buzz Teens Awards that were held at Katikati. And the winner for Teenies Teen TV Show Presenter goes to Sheila Kashumba. All right. Because of Mountain Dew, because of Buzz Teens Awards. All right. How old are you, by the way? <laughs> How are you doing? Thank you for the votes. I want to thank, um, first of all, um, I'm shaking, yeah, so my words are really not really composed, but I want to thank God for giving me this awesome talent. And if you know you want to be a TV star, 
You can do it. This young, beautiful and talented girl is just getting started and is definitely a force to look out for in this 21st century entertainment industry. Now guess what? Today I'm at Kawoja and it's their graduation day. And guess who else is graduating? Someone that we all know, someone that is part of the show. Today is Sheila's graduation and I want to know how she feels. I am so happy for her and I'm so proud of her. Hi Sheila. Hi. I'm good, how are you? I'm fine. How do you feel? I'm good. Awesome. Congrats, congrats. Thank you. So what are your big plans? Today is your graduation. Um, we just big, big plans today or big plans, you know, in life? Yeah, today. Today, um, have fun with my friends, you know, some of us are all, people are going back to their countries and yeah. It's all about the last day with everyone. Yeah. Okay, what do you, what's the advice for all of us who have graduated today? The thing is very simple. Concentrate on your studies. No one will love you like your parents. Listen to your parents first. The rest will follow. The good thing is that not only are we graduating, but we're also having a chance to interact. You know, to be next to very important people in this country. Right now, I'm standing next to the Rwandan ambassador. How are you? Sheila? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm good. How do you feel seeing young children graduating and moving from one step to another? Well, uh, this is one phase accomplished. Mm -hmm. And uh, like the messages were given by the chief guest and uh, the management of the school, the emphasis is about quality education. Mm -hmm. The education that enables people to move on and, uh, you know, uh, make up with their career. First of all, I'm very excited about you graduating. You. That is the biggest achievement. People used to see you on TV and were wondering, when does she go to school? I know. I'm glad to be a witness that you actually attended school. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. President, and His Excellency, Mr. 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 Mr.